Ferrari boss Mattia Binotto is growing tired of Mercedes always having an opinion and criticize the team for not yet agreeing a new deal for Lewis Hamilton. What's up guys from the news here and first up on today's episode, Ferrari takes a dig at Mercedes. The six time world champion is out of contract at the end of 2020 as is Valtteri Bottas but the Silver Arrows have said they won't be handing out new contracts before the 2020 season has started while also criticizing Ferrari for replacing Sebastian Vettel with Carlos Sainz for 2021 for that same reason. For Bernardo, it seems like he doesn't value Mercedes' opinion and can't understand why they haven't yet handed a new deal to Hamilton. Bernardo was also unhappy with Mercedes boss Toto Wolff for rejecting the idea of reverse grid sprint races at one of the two rounds that Austria and Great Britain each have this season to liven up the race weekends. Mercedes' disapproval meant the concept couldn't come to fruition and Ferrari was on board with it. Next up, Wolf suspicious of Ferrari engine power again. Toto Wolf, the boss of Mercedes F1 team, believes that the Ferrari engine will be very competitive again this season despite a relatively poor showing in mentor testing this year. Last year, the Ferrari engine was in turmoil because of its alleged illegal power output which was considered illegal by some competitors but was finally found to be compliant by the FIA. After launching an investigation into the Ferrari engine at the end of the 2019 season, the FIA finally reached an agreement, the terms of which were controversially remain secret with the Italian team and announced that it was impossible to prove that the Ferrari engine did not comply with the regulations. In other words, they probably bent the rules but nobody could prove it perhaps a big handicap of these incredibly complicated hybrid power units. For the 2020 season, Ferrari may not yet have revealed all its cards during the winter tests in Barcelona this winter. At least that's what Toto Wolff thinks, who believes that Mercedes will have to make sure to close the gap from the start of the year. On the other hand, Ferrari team boss is talking down the team's chances of a decent showing in Austria. Next up, Magnussen wants to stay with Haas. Haas F1 driver Kevin Magnussen says he has every intention of staying at Haas beyond the end of the current campaign, provided the team itself survives. The 27-year-old Dane joined Haas from Renault at the start of the 2017 campaign, replacing Esteban Gutierrez as Roman Grosjean's teammate. The following year, Haas took 5th place in the Constructors' Championship only to suffer a serious slump in 2019. Despite the American squad's downturn in fortunes, Magnussen insists that Haas is exactly where he wants to remain for some time to come. With the regulations being frozen at the end of 2020, the 27-year-old says it would make sense for teams to retain the same drivers for another season. With Magnussen about to embark on his fourth season with the team alongside Roman Grosjean, Magnussen says Haas has an option to retain him beyond the current season and the former McLaren F1 team and Renault F1 team feel it is a great place for him to be. With the coronavirus and the delays it has caused hurting teams financially, more teams on the grid are likely to require funding and should he require to pay for a seat in Formula 1, Magnussen says that he would not be on the grid. The one-time podium finisher in F1 says he would not be interested in looking for the funding to buy a place on the grid and believes that his time in the sport would come to an end. And lastly. Ferrari duo of Vettel and Leclerc set for a private test at Fiorano. Sebastian Vettel and Charles Leclerc will return to the wheel of a Formula 1 Ferrari later this month. Their duo are to take part in a test at the Scuderia's privately owned Fiorano track towards the end of June, understood to be the week commencing the 22nd, using an F1 car that is at least 2 years old as per the regulations. The test is designed to shake off any rust Vettel and Leclerc may be experiencing after almost 4 months of inactivity. Mercedes has already confirmed reigning 6-time world champion Lewis Hamilton and Valtteri Bottas will test this week at Silverstone with the Britain in the 2018 W09 on Wednesday and the Finn driving the day before. The test will also help Ferrari familiarize itself with the procedures required regarding social distancing and health checks that will be in place for the recently announced opening 8 races of the season around Europe. And that's been today's video. If you don't want to miss out on any Formula 1 news, then please hit that like and subscribe button for more top-notch F1 reports and insights. 
Apart from that, I hope you enjoyed the video, hope you had an awesome day, until next time, goodbye.